Hey folks, what's Welcome back to another Pokemon TCG unboxing video. And today we have this, which looks really, really cool. The <laughs> Blastoise VMAX, whatever it's called, Battle Box. It's in the bottom left corner there. See, Battle Box. So, <laughs> um, this looks amazing. This product looks really, really nice. First of all, the, the Blastoise VMAX card looks like fun, looks absolutely phenomenal. I'm a huge fan of, um, Blastoise's G Max. I think it's really, really well designed. Uh, um, yeah, look, look, look at that thing. It's like a whole like damn like fortress with like cannons everywhere. Plus, it's a turtle. Also, Blastoise, my favorite uh, starter, right? Um, although some days it fluctuates. Some days it's Blastoise. Some days it's it's uh, Blaziken. But most time it's Blastoise, I'd say. And um, those sleeves, like everything, just is so great about this. Like those sleeves look super, super cool as well. And obviously you have the packs. Anyways, without further ado, let's open this up. I also have the, the um, almost called it leaf, the Venusaur one. Unfortunately, no Charizard because this was, you know, Battle Styles is the the set about um, Isle of Armor, and obviously the big thing about Isle of Armor, or I guess one of the big things about Isle of Armor is that you get G Max, um, Blastoise, and, and Venusaur, right? So there's that. Anyways, let me pop this open real fast. Hopefully, I don't hurt myself in the process. That'd be kind of bad, I'd say. <laughs> Anyways, looks like it's, let me see. Seems like it's four packs, a jumbo card, and sleeves, unless there's more. So, yeah. Um. Oh, and as for the code cards, as usual, I will be posting them in the community tab. So, if you guys want that, you guys go check the community tab. Every few minutes or hours or so, I'll, I'll post another one so, you know, someone just doesn't go in there and get them all at once. Right. Okay, let's sleep this one up. Man, this card looks so cool. Look at this thing, man. Wow. Looks amazing. <laughs> the jumbo card, actually. Like, i usually not a huge jumbo card fan because, I mean, you know, first of all, it's hard to find a place for them. Which is, oh, you know what, that's like the main reason. But this Jumbo card looks really, really nice. I guess it's maybe because it's like a VMAX, because like the whole thing about like Gigantamax and Dynamax is they're just like Pokemon, but like big. <laughs> so like a Jumbo card, I guess, makes a bit more sense for them. But yeah, looks great as well, looks great as well. All right, that's for the sleeves. Again, I really do like the sleeves. I think they look fantastic as well. Um, just overall, really, really nice product. Kind of hard to find though. Um, took it took me a while to actually get this. This was um, actually like the main thing that was holding like my whole like order back, because it was hard for yeah you know, the the place that I bought it from to to get you know stock of this. So, anyways, um, not too many packs, even though like the box looks like humongous. Why is there glue on these? That's weird. Uh, but yeah, got two battle styles because obviously you know this is battle styles <laughs> box right uh darkness ablaze which i don't remember have i ever opened any darkness ablaze packs maybe not i don't remember opening any darkness ablaze so that's cool i might have like even if i did it's probably only just one or two packs and then we got sun and moon which for some reason we have in here i don't know why we have sun and moon in here but Okay, why not like Sword and Shield and Sun like Sun and Moon? If they want to like put put in like a base expansion, although I did hear um Sun and Moon get, got reprint recently, so that's something I guess. Uh, anyways, um, actually let's just start with the Sun and Moon one because this might be like the most or I guess the least interesting pack out of them all. All right, maybe I'd assume. Anyways, again, the uh the code cards in the community tabs if you guys want them. Also. If you guys are being them, please tell me what you get, because I'm super curious. <laughs> I like seeing what people pull. Alright, got a Lecture Type Energy to start. A Stene. I think that's how it pronounced, I'm not sure. Let's go, I got a frog, Poliwhirl. Brion. We're gonna get the frog luck. Uh, stop. Focus, please. Alright. Chincho. Paras. Poliwag, we got two frogs in one pack. Two Piter. Eevee. Oh, look at that reverse Rellet. That's really nice, isn't it? I love Rellets. It's just a cute Pokemon. 
and oh, Roxas. Um, as a huge psychic type Pokemon fan, I'm not a huge Bruxas. <laughs> I don't like Bruxas at all. <laughs> Unfortunately. Okay, it looks like the frogs didn't bring us the luck in this pack. But maybe it's the next one. Maybe it's the next one. Who knows? But yeah, definitely nothing in here. Like, I mean, the reverse Rowlet is nice. N not gonna, you know, take away from that. But the frogs did not come through. The frogs did not come through. Maybe it's just because it's still, like, uh, daytime outside. Because, again, the frogs just come out at night. And they're not around right now. Because it's probably very hot. And they're just, you know, in hiding. Because, I mean, I don't blame them. It's, like, it's incredibly hot today. So, if they want to come out, not a bad decision. All right, come on. All right. Let's see what we get here. Can the frogs come through from the last pack? Grass-type energy. Energy recycler. Oh, God. Can you please... Grumpig, Crawdon, Gliger, Hone Edge, Scatterbug. That's a really nice Scatterbug art, by the way. Houndor. Got a single strike Houndor. Come on. Frillish. Wow. Wow, that Houndoom looks cool. I know it's just like a reverse, but like, and well, it's a reverse art, but like, damn, it looks really, really nice. Look at that Houndoom, man. Probably one of the better uh, rare. Wow. Like, honestly, I know it's like, no, it's not, like nothing crazy, but damn, that art looks really, really nice. And Electivire. Regular rare. Nothing too crazy. Damn, so far our reverses have been much better than, <laughs> than our rares. Yikes. All right, let's get the Darkness Ablaze in. Rare uh, Darkness Ablaze pack opening on uh, on the channel. <gasps> Although I do have the whole um, Eternamax box right that i haven't opened yet and in there there's like a lot of um darkness ablaze stuff right anyways ah oh, am i gonna get shafted here come on give me something <laughs> fire type energy billing smoke semi sage clang shout out jasmine sufin kufin wishy-washy uh whoa Merlal, Panseer, Teddy Ursa, another Wishy Washy. Wait, didn't we just get one? Damn, it's it's the exact same one. And a regular Ampharos. I like this Ampharos though, it's just chilling. But it's nothing any, you know, it's nothing special. Yikes! Not not in the best position, I'd say, we're in. Um Can the last pack come through? Or are we gonna be forever shafted? On this Blastoise box. <laughs> Get the last pack. Pull through, man. Please. Please pull through. Ah. Come on. We've got two frogs. Electro type energy. Cac. Turn. Squirrel of Swirls. Seedra. Sizzlepede, Onyx, Chameco, Roly Coley, Blip Bug, Phalanx, Rapids Right Phalanx, and we got chapter. Learn <laughs> Slowbro, which is cool, but I mean, now yeah, we got chapter. <laughs> no, uh, no second wait about this. This box was um, an utter failure. <laughs> I'd say. Yeah, that was very, very bad. Very, very bad. Uh, Again, the, the Hound looks really, really cool, but outside of that, like, wow! <laughs> wow. Um, Well, for those who enjoy watching me getting shafted, congrats, I guess? <laughs> but yeah, this was not nice. At least, at least we got the really, really nice Blossoms being Max cards, so there's that. Plus, it's a really cool Houndoom card. I think you would rather um, reverse, but yeah, none of these were nice. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully these code cards that you guys will get in a bit would have much, much better pulls than whatever the heck I just got. <laughs> uh, but anyways, that's me with this one, I guess. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I, I don't know if I enjoyed it or not. <laughs> uh, bad pulls plus it's really, really hot right now. 
um, in the room. So, no, it was not the most enjoyable <laughs> pulls, uh, I have to say. But hopefully the Venusaur one gives us a bit more luck. Ho hopefully the Venusaur one does. I do like the Venusaur sleeves better than the Blastoise ones. So, hopefully that one is better. <laughs>